Alright, what's going on guys? It's Ryan or Gavi here, and welcome to the story of my absolute idiocy. So it all really begins with yesterday, when I decided my room really needs to be cleaned. And before you start saying, oh you suck at surfing, this was my first time ever surfing. So if you have any suggestions for me, leave them in the comments below. And before you start saying I'm turning into Leafy. Really? Really? So basically this is what happened to me. I, I was cleaning my room, you know, casually as you do, you have a few dishes in there. So, I see this glass, you know, this just tiny, it's not a tiny glass, it was like a beer glass, one that you'd put beer in, but it just had, it had nothing in it. Like, I, I don't drink or anything before people start making that assumption. I don't, I don't drink, I don't do any of that, it's not who I am, it's not what I want to be. Um, but simply, what happened is, I, I went to pick it up with my left hand, and it shattered when I picked it up. It, I picked it up, it shattered in my hand, and it left a huge, huge, huge cut on my pinky. And right now, as of right now, I cannot use that finger. And I promise you, you do not realize how often you use that finger until you can't use it. Because right now I'm walking around with a splint on my finger, and it's probably one of the most miserable things ever, because it's really, really painful. And... Whenever I hit something with it, it stings. Whenever I do anything with it, it, it just stings. It's horrible. And to top it off, the next morning, we got a ton of snow the, the day before. And I'm talking like 10, 11 inches. And I'm getting out of the car to go to school. And I noticed something fell. And I didn't think much of it at the time. But it turns out, when I got inside, that it was my phone. Every teenager's worst nightmare right there just came true for me. It was my phone that I felt just fall out of my pocket, and I thought it fell onto the front seat of my mom's car, to be honest. Like, I, I didn't think it was going to be a big deal, and I was like, hey, mom, can you come drop off my phone at school? I get nothing for hours, and then eventually school finishes, and I'm like, alright, still haven't found my phone yet, I wonder where, where it is, and... I, I go I go to look for it where my mom parked out her car and right there in the snowbank is my phone that I was missing for the entire day. That thing was sitting out in the snowbank for seven hours straight. Seven hours. I pick it up and I'm like shit this thing's this thing's not gonna work. This thing's gone. It is just gone. And I turn I try to turn it on and, it, and it's just the lock screen. And I I have so many messages, snapchats, emails, tweets, all of that. I just have so much of it. I normally check my phone at least every 10 minutes, if, if not more. And I have never gone 7 hours without checking my phone except when I'm asleep. And there was so much on my phone. Just, like, I can't believe that I, I didn't break it somehow. And I'm on my way home. And everyone's just like, they saw me pick up my phone, and they're like, yo, you're lucky you found it, because if that was me, I'm not gonna lie, I would've picked that up and just walked away with it. And I'm like, yeah, you're you're a scumbag, that's that's cool. I honestly can't believe that I did this. Like, how stupid can I be? How how actually dumb can I be? I, I don't I don't get it. I'm I'm an actual idiot. That's why I tweeted out earlier saying this. Uh, I am the world's biggest idiot. And I stand by those words now as we speak. So, it's lovely. But anyways, it's besides the point right now, guys. Stuff happens, things happen. I'm gonna be okay. My phone's fine, my finger's fine. I didn't need stitches or anything. And I just wanna take a minute to talk about everything that's been going on lately. So, I took a two-week break from YouTube just to regather my grades and thoughts and everything. And that was probably the smartest de decision I've ever made in my life. Because in the past two weeks, I've managed to get really good grades. And I've just become much happier of a person. I really missed editing videos. I really missed making videos for you guys. But I really needed that two weeks because, man, I just feel so much better now. And I just want to make such better content for you guys and everything. So, uh, be sure to leave your uh, feedback for surfing and everything in the comments below. And... Yeah, guys, I'll talk to you later, and I have my trade link in the description. If you guys really want to send me skins or whatever, I, that's my trade link. Go have at it. Uh, please do not send me your knives. Just kidding. Feel free to send me all your knives that you have. But anyways, I'll talk to you guys later. It's been Ryan or Gavi here, and tell me if you like this video uh, format, because I might do a little bit more of it when I tell stories. So I'll talk to you later.
it's Ryan or Gabby here, and peace. That I'm at an all time. <laughs>